There are two primary types of data structures provided by Pandas. The first and most popular is the data frame. The second is the series. Picture a data frame is merely an Excel worksheet or SQL table. It is made up of rows and columns, and each cell within those rows and columns has a value, be it a number or a string. The part that makes it extra special is that every value holds a unique index too. The columns will typically have names and the rows will typically have the indexes we just mentioned. A series is basically a single column of a data frame, which is a one-dimensional labeled array. We can create them from data frames by selecting the column we want as a series, or we can create them from a Python list. We'll learn more about series after first exploring the data frame in depth. So basically, a series is the data structure for a single column of a data frame. What's interesting is that the data in a data frame is literally stored in the memory as a collection of series. So again, a data frame is basically a collection of series, which are really just rows in a single column, that combine together to make a data frame, which ends up looking like a table with rows and columns names. A pandas data frame can be created using various inputs like lists, dictionaries, series, numpy arrays, or another data frame. We can also create data frames by reading in files such as CSV, Excel, or even SQL queries. In our instance, we will primarily create data frames by configured CSV files.